My husband poured our daughter's ashes into the toilet and threw her URN at me. I feel so alone and I don't know where to turn to. I had to spend the night in my car last night. I couldn't sleep through crying, trying to stay warm enough and thinking that somebody was going to suddenly appear at the windows. I've been trying to find a place to park up so I can try to sleep today and I've found a place but I can't rest. I feel so empty and scared. I don't want to go into much detail here but our daughter passed away very suddenly last year. My husband and I both got help and have tried to work through it together, but his drinking has been getting more and more out of control. It got to a point where he started to try to hide it but it was making his behavior worse. I had a breakdown two months after our daughter passed and I hadn't been work since. I had quite a bit put away in savings and some money I inherited, so I was using that to contribute at home while I've tried to get myself back in better health. In January my husband started on his sobriety journey but his business started to suffer. There were some difficulties through the lockdowns and we both worked hard to make sure the business made it through. He took out a loan earlier this year and I gave him the rest of my savings and started back at work. Things were going well with the business and as well as they could have been for us, until he relapsed last month and was hiding it from me. I lost my job two weeks ago and have been looking for work since. It's been stressful but nothing we couldn't have managed. Yesterday I got home and my husband was already home and was very drunk. It was a very loud and out of control kind of state he was in and he was slamming around the house, saying he was looking for something. I couldn't get much sense out of him and he was really irate. I didn't really know what to do and when I tried to ask if he was okay he got in my face and was quite aggressive with me. He randomly started to throw accusations at me, accusing me of all kinds of things that I have no idea where any of it came from. I was scared at that point and didn't want to be in the house with him, I hadn't seen him that angry before and I think it was a build up of grief that had come spilling out, but I felt scared. I put my shoes and coat on and told him I was going to head out for a while. That's when he snapped and accused me of trying to leave him. It all happened very suddenly but he charged at me and got hold of my arm and threw me onto the floor and pulled me down the hallway. At some point of him drunkenly shouting about him not letting me leave him, he suddenly stopped and told me he was going to give me a reason to hate him so much. He stormed off into the front room, took the urn with our daughter in and headed to the downstairs toilet. I got up and tried to stop him from doing whatever he was able to do. When he went towards the toilet I was trying to stop him and was pleading with him not to. He shoved me quite hard and I fell. He poured all of the ashes into the toilet and threw her urn at me, hitting my leg. He then started yelling at me to get out before he killed me. I was shaking and felt like I was frozen but I managed to get up and run to the front door. I took my keys and my handbag and drove off. I had no idea where to go, so parked up in a quiet area and just cried. I have done practically nothing but cry since. I have no family around and no friends that I can turn to who are close by. I was sick earlier on but I've managed to keep some water down. I thankfully keep a supply of it in the car. I don't know what to do. I switched my phone off all night in case he tried to contact me. I didn't want to hear from him. He's tried to call me today but I can't be around him while he is drinking again. I can't let him keep taking his anger out on me like this. I feel like it's all my fault. Everything. I just needed to vent. I'm exhausted of feeling like this.